house. It is my comforter. Yeah. It is my director, Let's my instructor. My all in all, we can the pastor, the evangelist, the wife of the ministers, all the saints, children, and the greeting in the precious name of Jesus. I God be good to you this week. I said, God be good to you this week. As we have a subject before us, we have to understand, brethren, we just sing the song, Thou art my knees when sorrow rise. Daniel did not wait to sorrow rise. Preach. Preach. It is our time to wait to wait to find ourselves. In a difficult situation, that's the time we begin. We start to pray. Amen. But Daniel did not start to pray when he found himself in the lion's den. Because that was, it was his first time to do it. You see, we, we, we don't, we, we, we forgot the custom of prayer. We wait to wait. We shoot it to the back when everything going good. We can know we can know when when the when the time is rough. Because uh, you understand me that I that, that identify that you're going through a rough time because that's the time you start to ask the church to pray. Amen. And it should not be like that person. Daniel! We know the story. Yes. They were taken from captivity. Yes. Glory to God. Yeah. But that although the name was changed, Daniel custom did not change. Yes. Yes. I say his name was changed, but his custom did not change. Because Daniel know the God is served. And he changed not to the same God today and even forevermore. Daniel know the God that he served that he will establish it. When I read he said Daniel was not in, he was not second. He said that he was first among the princes. That's what we're talking about brethren. When you are a child of God, God will establish you among your fellow men. Praise the Lord. Amen. Amen. I believe. And as you get, as God starts to establish you, you're always going to have people who do not like you. And God. God have mercy. Amen. And they will always want to plot against you. Yes. They always want to try to put you down. Yes. And we can see that they go to the king. And that's time they had the king make it in writing. Yes. Because he know that when he passed the decree, he cannot go back, he cannot reverse. But that did not stop Daniel. No, sir. The Bible said that he went in and in unto his chamber. Yes, And he's opened his window. Amen. Because that's what he knows to do. We have to understand as a church brethren, that they never, never try to, to talk himself out of this. You see, sometimes we as a church, when we try to talk ourselves out of situation, but Daniel did not do that. Daniel prayed himself out of it. And that's what we do sometimes as men. You understand me? We try, we try to, to, to justify ourselves in a stand there and say, why I do this and why I do that. Daniel did not, did Daniel did not try to do nothing. Yes, but he said that he called upon God. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. And brethren, as we as children of God, we should make 
for a routine prior to your part of a routine day. We have to make sure that we don't just take prayer in a Sunday because somebody told you to, to, to pray. Amen. Because the Bible said that Daniel paid prayer three times. Yes. For you can pray seven. Please. For you have the time to pray seven. Nothing wrong with that. Amen. If you understand that Daniel was in, he was, he, he was here, don't be popular. And he busy. But see, he takes out he made time. The the we have to make time as children of God to talk to God. Yes, sir. Amen. So you understand where I said that we pray Amen. and God is yes. So many times we are children. We are going through a rough time. Only thing we can do is just pray us a way out of it. As Daniel, God was stopping from going to land there. Sometimes sickness, God can stop sickness upon you. But still, He may, He may, He may come that you can seek Him more. I could hear Paul say, I, I seek the Lord Christ for my infirmity. But I hear God, I hear King, I hear Sarah. So we have to understand the God we are serving. Amen. When you are going to it, he is the one who brings it in it. Yes. yes. If God don't bring it in, you can't go in it. Because he is the one who brings it in it. God, he wants to bring it out of it. Amen. We see that Daniel was showing because the men they are watching. The man they trying. It's the people. They are going out as a child of God. They just looking for you to fall. They just me. They just watching you and see. They just tell me when they gonna make a mistake because they wanted to throw it in your face. And that's what the man were. They were looking. They just me. They were looking at that there and see what we can use against him. What we can use against him. And when they look, they could find nothing. Oh yes. And we are nice now. Of the man that pray, he pray often now. Brilliant. Yes, we got, we got to, we got to come up with something now. Let us stop it now. We can't find nothing else. Let us stop it. This man call upon his God too much now. That's what we got to use now. Yeah. Amen. It's hard to say. <laughs> Sometimes people will use church as a weapon against you. That's true. Oh my God. Amen. Amen. They will talk and say, oh. You talk so holy and, 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 you, and you walk holy. You understand me? They will try to use yeah. that against you. Yeah. Because that's what they use against Daniel. They use his, his prayer life against him. Yeah. That's what people will use against you. You understand me? Oh, oh, you talking like that and all, and all you who dress like that. They will use righteousness against you. Because that's what they use against Daniel. His prayer life. But I like Daniel, he did not, he, he did not, he did not talk to himself. No, no. When I read the Bible, he did not tell me that Daniel bear unseemly. No. <laughs> the man show respect when the king called him. Yes. You understand me? The man demanded it, the man show respect. You understand me? Sometimes we are children of God. When we go into that, somebody says something. We just need to pop just like we are from. And it should not be like that. We have to humble ourselves, Richard. Amen. Because we have to understand when you pray, Amen. just leave it. Amen. We have to recognize, Richard, your prayer must be sincere. Amen. We have to understand the publican, he pray out loud, but he was not sincere. Sometimes we have great words, but it's not sincere. We have to understand great things. That's the part of the prayer, the sinceres. 
That's why we're talking about. We have to make sure that when I'm when I'm praying, I hear me I ain't just praying for a show, but I'm praying because I feel it. I feel your feeling. I feel your pain. Amen. We have to make sure that when we are reaching out, get us standing person. We are not reaching to man, but we are reaching to God. Get us standing man. Look at the old one of prayers. So sometimes, you understand me, I can come here and I, and I lay my hands and start to pray. But God knows if, if my heart is right. Amen. The Bible is talking about sincere prayer. And that's what it takes, brethren. We can do great things if we are sincere, brethren. We can do great things as a church, but if we are sincere in our prayers. Jesus, he said, Sir, and Sir, I said to him, Don't speak the words. Yes, ma'am. Yes. He said, I'm not worthy. Yes. For you come under my roof. My roof. But just speak the words. Yes. We have to understand it, brethren. We have to be sincere in all we're doing, not only in prayer, Amen. but in everything we're doing. Yes. And we see that Daniel, he said that the Lord sent angels to shut the lion's mouth. Yes. And they do me no harm. That's the God we are still serving this morning. Amen. He changed that brethren. When you are going through it, believe that God is able to see us through brethren. You got to believe. Amen. Don't make sense. You are praying and not believe. Amen. 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 And I'm man of God again. Help my unbelief. Amen. 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 Sometimes when I need them, I say, Lord, help my unbelief because mm -hmm. we sometimes the human side take off. Yes. But we have to ask the Lord to help our unbelief. Because when we pray, we're all looking for wisdom. Amen. Which person don't pray? Which person pray not looking for wisdom? We are all looking for wisdom. But pray to let our prayer be sincere. Sometimes we pray and it takes a while. Yes. It's just like the same Daniel. Yeah. 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 And that's time God. He said, I hear a long time for you pray. Yeah. Yeah. But the prince of the year, oh, we stood. Yeah. 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 So we have to understand. So sometimes you pray and don't get a deliverance right away. But the prince of the year hold it. And I have to send somebody else to deliver it. So don't stop praying because God get a stop the ease and deliver. So you don't stop praying because you stop it because you don't get it right away. Get a stop it. You get fed up on your head and get discouraged and say, I ain't praying no more. Get a stop it. No, continue to pray because prayer is God. It's what hope in every door. If you don't have the key, you cannot open a door. Amen. So you have to make sure you have the. If you're coming in and out, you understand me? This door carry a key. The prayer is what opens it. Yes. And if you don't travel with the key, you cannot open the door. Amen. So we have to understand that they did not cease from doing what he knows to do. Let us, as a church, brethren, make sure our prayer is sincere. Because God, as I said, God is the one who really heart. Me and Evangel and Pastor, the rest of preaching, we only can judge from what you say. We only can judge from all to one appearance. But God knows the heart. So pray that your prayer be sincere, that we can get the result that we are looking for. Amen. <laughs> Beautiful, beautiful Zion, yeah. We're marching upward to Zion.